Folks, in Colorado, the autopsy of a black man who died at the police of a police encounter uh, in the Denver suburb uh, three years ago now says the cause of death was due to potent sedatives that were injected into him. Elijah McClain died after being forcibly restrained and injected with ketamine after being stopped by police in Aurora for being suspicious. The original autopsy report of the 23-year-old was written soon after his death and did not conclude how he died or what type of death it was, such as if it was natural, accidental, or a homicide. That was a significant reason why prosecutors initially decided not to pursue charges against the cops and the EMT officials. Last year, a state grand jury indicted three officers and two paramedics on manslaughter and reckless homicide charges in McLean's death after the case drew renewed national attention following the killing of George Floyd in 2020. Now we see exactly what caused the death and folks were still saying, why was he even injected in the first place? All right, folks, back to our Roadmark Unfiltered video in just one moment. When we invest in ourselves, our glow, our vision, our vibe, we all shine. Together, we are Black Beyond Measure. Folks, Black Star Network is here. Hold no punches. I'm real uh, revolutionary right now. Black Black Black. Black. Support this man, Black Media. He makes sure that our stories are told. Uh, thank you for being the voice of Black America, Roller. I love y'all. All momentum we have now, we have to keep this going. The video looks phenomenal. See, there's a difference between Black Star Network and Black-owned media and something like CNN. You can't be Black-owned media and be scared. It's time to be smart. Bring your eyeballs home. You dig? 